After a full day of work, I like to give myself a little spa at home treatment. I slip into my soak and sleep bathrobe and it's time to relax. I usually start by removing my makeup and you know how I do it if you watched my bedtime routine. Next step would be to put these curls in a little low bun just to get the hair out of the way. My pamper session always starts with a face mask and this time I'm using Rodiel Super Acids Extreme Acid Rush Peel. I use three pumps which I then just apply generously all over the face, avoiding the eye area. It feels really tingly and you know, I love when a face mask gives me that feeling because then I know it works. I love this product because it contains azelaic glycolic and lactic acid which exfoliate my skin and give it that kind of luminous and brightening effect. It makes my skin softer and reduces any imperfections or wrinkles. Then it's time for Rodeal Dragon's Blood Eye Masks. I just love eye masks and this product is definitely one of my favorites because it rehydrates my dry skin around the eyes and it makes it look less translucent but more fresh and wide awake. It gives you that real spa at home treatment because it's really easy but kind of special to use because you have these little pads that you put around your eyes and you can feel the instant hydration boost. Of course, I cannot live without lip balm and this is the NYX one which I'm using a lot lately. While my face masks are sinking in, I'm gonna be having a bath. I'm baking a lush bomb. I'm already on to lighting candles and just creating a bit of a relaxing atmosphere while I'm in the bath. Harvest Peaches and Japanese Cherry Blossom are my two favorite candles by Bath & Body Works at the moment. Then it's time to run the bath and enjoy the process of melting this bath bomb. Space Girl makes your bath really pink and purpley, gorgeous color and smelling fruity sweet. While in the bath, I exfoliate with the Body Shop Mango Scrub. Then it's time to shave the legs with Pure Seduction Foaming Gel. I just love how this smells and works. And I use Rose Argan Body Conditioner by Lush. I love how it smells and makes my skin feel so soft. I often read a book in the bath and currently I'm reading Paolo Coelho's latest one. After bath, I wash my face and remove the eye gel pads. Currently, I'm obsessed with Kiehl's Creme de Corps. I just love the pump, I find it so easy to apply and it moisturizes my skin better than any other body lotion. I often need a bit of time to do my nails because I like to do it with the nail gel. After I've picked the right color, I make sure to buff my nails and then I use this red carpet gel polish system. I love this because it makes my nail polish stay much longer, my nails are shinier and a lot harder. It's a very simple process. After you've prepped your nails, you apply a base coat, which is called structure. Then you can apply some gel color polish, which I'm not doing this time, and you just finish it all with shine. While doing this, I often check my Instagram, upload a picture, or just watch some YouTube videos. Today I will paint my nails with OPI Sweetheart, it's one of my favorite nail polishes and it lasts me much longer with a gel base. Mm -hmm. 
And then it's tea time. I will be having this clipper snore and peace tea, which is just perfect for relaxing and sort of just winding down after a long day. A spoon of honey and I'm ready to go. While reading a book in bed, I like to moisturize my hands and I will be using Avida's Hand Relief Serum. This product is supposed to renew your skin during the night, but I also use it during the day. And, of course, Lush Lemony Flutter Cuticle Butter, which I love so much. And that's it guys, I hope you will be inspired to enjoy in your own spa at home night. See you soon, bye!